clear. Go, stop, wait, go fast. What's up, Chief? The life of a soldier. Couldn't wait till morning. Okay, last time, I think we looked over here, here, and maybe here. Is that what you remember? I don't know. Does it matter? If we missed something the first time, we should look at everything again. Yeah, good point. Okay. Do you think the river is higher or lower than it was? Come on, man. Stop asking me to remember things. As soon as Operation Lone Wolf got called off last time, I completely pushed it from my mind. You find something? Over there! Get ready to fight! Full up. Can't carry any more. Forward team, why the fuck are you still looking for that box? You have hostiles in your area. Well, Dr. Dominguez. I don't give a Ooh, damn about up. Dominguez. Find Lara more. Croft and kill her. Find Lara Croft, how? We're spread out way too goddamn thin for that. This was a research operation. Let's just spread out and make the best of it. I'll cover that area. You stay here. Lara Croft. You have to admire her persistence. I told you to stick around. supposed to listen to? Well, Rourke is a military leader and Dominguez's decisions are getting people killed. So 
So you better decide right now where your loyalties lie. Are you this is not the time to fucking wander off. <laughs> Twenty-first of December, 1603. Lopez had grown pensive since exiting the cenote. I led the way, and when I turned toward the city, at last he spoke, calling for us to stop. Then, after swearing me to silence, he shared with me a secret he had been carrying. That night, by the river, I met with the Emperor. I confessed to him who I was, who we are, and the true purpose of our visit. Trinity's fattened leaders, too busy with politics for even the morning's prayers, are not worthy of the box. The Emperor and I agreed that the only way to keep it safe from them was for me to claim it, take it far from here and hide it until one of the Paititi royal line, a chosen one, can follow his antecedents clues and rediscover it. Having thus unburdened himself, Lopez turned on his heels and set a course deeper into the jungle. Shock damage in Julia 3. A rock slide took out the tertiary pumping platform. No fires. Fallen trees and we'll put the rocky access road to Kilo 2. This is a record of a mercenary's assignments while working for Trinity. Mexico, Kenya, Siberia. I had my crosshairs on the younger one too, but Rourke had orders for us to leave her alone. This is the bastard who shot Anna. What the hell? What the hell am I supposed to do? Hunaratu's dead, shot in the back by Rourke. I don't have the box. Jonah. If anything happens to him. God damn it. Who is this? I've suspected you've been monitoring my communications since Mexico. <sighs> Rourke. Commander Rourke. You've been listening to me. And now, I'm listening to you. Another foreshock. How's it feel? 
knowing you're responsible for all these cataclysms, all that suffering. I know what I did. The look on your face when Dominguez told you? But you just had to have that dagger, didn't you? Forward outpost. Croft is moving into your area. Find her. Cross it right through the guys at the beach. It can't happen again. We'd better do a sweep. Anything interesting in that new shipment? Thermal goggles, gentlemen. I'll take point. I got something! Where? Positive. Some animal. Hey, are we getting those lights up or what? I'm never gonna get them working if you keep pestering me. What's the damn hurry all of a sudden? Rourke said Croft's coming through here. God damn it. All right, I'm hurrying. Here we go. Shit, I'm tired of covering for these assholes. <laughs> Outpost. On something, we'll advise. Keep your heads up! Better look at that.
God damn it, people, use the goggles. Find her. Evening, Ralph. Evening, Sam. Did you see anyone? If I did, I'd be shooting. As if looking for something in the dark in these ruins wasn't creepy enough. I used to go hunting with my dad in conditions just like this. Except the ruins were creepy old trees. All right, got any pointers? No matter how good the prey is at staying hidden, it can't go without a mistake forever. All it takes is one tiny slip, and it's all over. We've got to stop her. Don't worry. We will. Yeah? You that sure of the new equipment? No, but I'm sure of Rourke. Take a casualty! Copy that. We'll find you. Jesus. I need to get to the bottom of this. Full up. I can't spot. carry any more. Stay close. Signal if you see anything. Only a matter of time. I got a blank. She'll turn up. Need to search there. No chance of her getting away. Warm up.
It's a recipe for a hallucinogen, sometimes used in war. This should help. If I use this on my arrows, it could be an advantage against Trinity. Trinity can rot in this jungle. And as for the Pytetian Emperor, not even he can truly understand just what this box is. But I do, and I know it should not be used by just anyone. That would be catastrophic. Only the purest among us should make the decision as to how to wield the power of the silver box. That is why I must hide it. Must be Mama Zara. <laughs> I always thought her forms of worship were a fun tradition. She was the Incan goddess of grain, and her name means maize mother. So if ever a farmer found a strange maize plant, they would dress it up like a doll in honor of her. She was also the goddess of willow trees, so sometimes the farming communities would hang one of their maize dolls from a willow tree and dance around it for her. I say again, Croft is coming to you. Jesus Christ. Shh. We'll get her, sir. Show me her corpse, and your entire team is next in line for deacon training. Rourke out. You heard the man. Let's do this. You aren't looking too good. Base camp's having trouble receiving me. As soon as this is up, we'll use it to boost your signal. That should have worked. Why isn't it working?
gotta find something. Gotta investigate. Sweep the area! High and tight! Right with you. Jonah? Jonah, come in, please. He's not gonna answer, Lara. What? He's dead. Now you can add your friend Jonah to the list of people you've gotten killed. Fuck you, Rock. If you want to pick up his body, it's at the refinery. I'm coming for you. Dominguez forbade us from mingling with the locals. Didn't want us corrupting them. Luckily, one of the priests developed a taste for bourbon, and as long as I brought a pint with me, he'd lend me his costume, mask and all. Walking through the lower city was like traveling 500 years into the past. <laughs> 